they arrested her in her bathing suit, correct? Yeah. Well, yeah. how'd you feel about that when you when you f- first heard about what had happened? Okay, first I want to cry right now just thinking about it. Latoya Harris talked to me about the night last May when her nine-year-old daughter, still wet in a swimming suit, was hauled off in a police car in handcuffs. It was the fact I couldn't protect my daughter from the very people that are supposed to be protecting us. And the shame and the fear on her face and the... It, it, it hurts. LaToya tells me that her daughter was humiliated as she was marched before her friends to the waiting police car. She had to change schools, actually, says LaToya, because of the humiliation. So today I went to Portland police searching for answers. Why arrest a nine-year-old girl? Why put her in handcuffs and drive her to downtown Portland's central precinct? Police are not talking publicly about the arrest, but they do tell me they don't have firm age guidelines when it comes to arresting people. And handcuffs in the back of a patrol car is not only a matter of policy, say police, but a matter of safety for everyone in the car. Is there any purpose in taking a nine-year-old to an adult, regular adult facility? I don't think so. I asked juvenile public defender Joseph Hagedorn about this arrest. He thinks police made a series of wrong decisions here, starting with the arrest itself and ending with them dropping a nine-year-old girl in a jail cell. You have a nine-year-old, you have a safe home, um, you can make a referral to the juvenile department. You have plenty of options um, at your fingertips as an officer. Cor Harlan, Coin 6 News.